Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and stay tuned by clicking the bell icon. Emmerdale abuse scandal escalates as EastEnders exposes a villain in 25 major soap spoilers for next week. Emmerdale's Bell Dingle faces husband Tom King's wrath as his harrowing behavior continues to reach new heights while EastEnders rapist Teen Wicks is once again called into question after a warning from someone who knows very well what he's capable of. Over in Hollyoaks, Stehey and James Nightingale are left fighting for their lives as Warren Fox is on the warpath, helped on finding out all there is to know about Ella Richardson's demise, while Coronation Street's Roy Cropper is abused and bullied by locals who jump to the wrong conclusion. In Ramsey Street, Negra's latest resident schemer, Chelsea Murphy, takes her most shocking action, yet in a bid to win Paul Robinson's affection. The soaps are all going to be tough to watch next week, and I've got all the latest spoilers so you have an inkling of what's to come ahead of the drama. 1. Stacy urges Jack to do whatever Denise asks in a bid to protect their secret. A family barbecue brings together both sides of Charlie's family. But in the backyard, Stacy and Jack share a tender goodbye kiss, just as Martin walks in on them. 2. Jade's fundraiser is set to take place at the Vic, under the agreement that Dean doesn't attend. Dean, however, manipulates his way into the event to see Jade's speech, and he begs his daughter to stay in Walford, but Jade wants to go to Pakistan with her mom. Linda, meanwhile, manages to make Jean see that Dean is playing her. 3. Honey is horrified to catch Will vaping and demands to know who sold it to him. After finding out that Avani is to blame, she storms over to confront Priya but Priya isn't all that bothered. Ravi, however, apologizes. 4. George is made a fuss of on his birthday. Gloria's arrival sets the cat among the pigeons, but she just wants to talk with George agreeing to hear her out. Gloria insists that he had a happy childhood, but it all proves too much for George, who loses his temper, leading him to break down in Elaine's arms. 5. Penny tries to persuade Lauren to have a 30th birthday celebration, but she's not keen, especially when Peter tells her that he's got a date that night. 6. Priya and Ravid bond over a vanny, leading Ravi to ask her to join him for a drink. Priya, however, knocks him back in favor of Martin, who has just arrived at Peggy's. 7. With Roy in the frame for Lauren's murder, Max pays Reese a visit in prison to find out if the far-right group could be involved, but when he lets slip about Roy being implicated, two dodgy men confront Roy at the cafe, locking the door. 8. Dylan pleads guilty to carrying a knife in a public place, and he thanks Seen for his support, after he's handed a community service order. There's more conflict, however, when the pair return home to find Eileen with Violet, who had no clue about what's gone on. Violet turns her attention to Scene, blaming him for being a lousy parent. 9. Paul is slurring his words and his new PA struggles to understand him. Billy tries to play it down, but Summer tells him that they need to face facts. Paul's speech is deteriorating. 10. Tracy is left reeling when Steve, on Amy's request, breaks the news that Tommy has accepted a job in Spain. 11. Lean attends another seminar with Rowan, who is delighted to see her. The pair discuss the seminar afterwards, with Rowan commenting that he hopes to see her again. Lean enthuses to Nick about how she finds Rowan to be quite inspirational. 12. Despite things still being frosty between them and Chess sleeping on the sofa, Gemma and Chesney put on a brave face and visit Oak Hill with Linda and Joseph. But it soon becomes clear that something is bothering Joseph. 13. Kane, Caleb, and Aaron prepare to find out if they've inherited the faulty BRCA2 gene. Morit is relieved when Kane tests negative while there is similar relief over at the Milligan household when Caleb also tests negative. Aaron, however, finds out that he's inherited the gene and when quizzed by Chas, he lies. 14. Chas and Patty's kiss lingers in the air, much to Mandy's dismay, but the beautician claims that she just wants to move on. Marlon, however, lets slip at his party that Chas 15. broke off the kiss. Tom berates Belle over her decision to postpone having children. Belle, however, is soon distracted when Susie references the job offer at Take a Vow, which she was previously unaware of. Knowing Tom was to blame for keeping it from her, Belle confronts him, but he manages to appease her. 16. Pollard is intrigued when Emmett presents a lucrative business opportunity, with the two businessmen bonding. Rodney, however, warns him against trusting Emmett. 17. Romance blossoms for Lyme and Ella. 18. Stiz worried sick for his loved one's safety as Warren is on the warpath. Things are complicated further when Warren answers James' phone, urging Stee to seek him out at once or else. Stee does as he's told, arriving to help James, 
who is in worn and heavy Murphy's grasp. The husbands attempt to escape, but they're chased onto the roof of a multi-story car park, where Stee admits he killed Ella as a fight breaks out, with shocking consequences set to ensue. 19. Leela invites Mercedes to her gender reveal party, but Mercedes realizes she wants one too, with Leela upset as the former dog landlady turns the event into a joint party. A fight breaks out between Abe and Joel, but the feuding siblings are stopped in their tracks by the sudden arrival of their mum Marie, who is wearing Mercedes' dress. 20. Sally is told by Sharon that she should talk to John Paul about what they discussed in an off-screen conversation. Sally brushes it off, claiming there's nothing to be worried about, telling John Paul that she'll get scanned results in a few weeks. 21. Frankie breaks down to Lucas. JJ interrupts and orders Lucas to stay away from his sister. 22. Chelsea is livid as Paul heaps praise on Krista for the lion's success, and she starts to feel pushed out even more when he refuses to remove the provision in his will for Therese. Realizing that children are the way to his heart, Chelsea discards her contraceptive pills and attempts to seduce Paul once more. 23. On Paul's advice, Therese resolves to visit her children in Adelaide. Now, meanwhile, encourages Toadie to fight for their marriage, and he decides to do just that, writing a letter to his wife, begging her to meet him at the camping spot where they first kissed. 24. Haz is surprised when Harold's wins a council business award. On a celebratory picnic, Mackenzie and Haz trade their own cute versions of I Love You, but their joy is short-lived that the cafe is subsequently trashed. 25. JG approaches Felix for more self-defense advice. It hits Felix that JJ is emotionally relying on him and Felix withdraws, leaving JJ feeling let down. If you liked the video, don't forget to like, comment, and share.